This is uh, April 28th, 2024, Darcy's Corner. And I'm feeling a little bit um, inspired, I guess, just to talk a little bit about uh, tenacity and how you can't just like, when life throws you a curveball, you just gotta learn to duck or, you know, knock it out of the park. But the thing is, you don't have a choice in life when it does that to you. It does that to me a lot, and I've spent my whole life just ducking curveballs, man. And sometimes I get out of the way, and sometimes I get hit. And right now, I'm kind of hit. I'm one or two lucky breaks away from life being just peachy, and I'm one or two bad breaks away from, like, giving up entirely so it's kind of important to me that I keep a positive uh, social network around me so I will avoid people who want to remind me what a failure I am like thanks I didn't notice you know the last um, employer was not worth my time um, who was hired me just to fire me basically is how I felt the entire time I was there as things would happen from time to time I was like when is this end what are you gonna, when are you going to quit and I'm like what are you talking about I don't quit I do not quit okay I haven't got anything else going for me in life I love the sound of the dog drinking water in the background there I got nothing else going for me in life except the fact that I don't quit. Because what else are you going to do? At this stage, when failures happen, like, what does quitting look like now, right? Nothing anybody really wants to think about too much. So I'm not quitting. That doesn't mean life won't quit me. Okay, I could get cancer tomorrow. I get some sort of a life altering event could happen. I could get hit by a car, mess up my back. I could get Alzheimer's. What? Yeah. Like, you know, these things happen to people. But barring those life altering events, I don't quit. I just keep going. And. Maybe that's not the way to live your life. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a failure and should stop trying. Next time somebody asks you to quit, you know, are you encouraging me to unalive myself? Because that's kind of what it sounds like to me. So maybe you shouldn't do that. And also, like, I just won't associate with you because, you know, you're a fair weather friend. When life is going good, I can be around you. And when it's going bad, I can't count on you. Because you'll just remind me of how bad things are. Thanks. Appreciate that. <laughs> I did notice the house was on fire. Thank you. That is why I'm throwing the water. Like, you know. Tennessee's ramble. Anyway, point is, you can't quit. You keep going, and eventually you will get to the other side. There is another side. It's just sometimes it's a really long road. Peace.